in my brain, but then when you play it out, Ding Dong is true at like every percent. So yeah. it's just, it's not a good Ridley time. Ridley only. Ridley. It actually might be his worst matchup. If I'm not honest. mistaken, it is Ridley only. And I think the traditional Ding Dong still works it on does. this character. It like, does. You don't even have to go for the improvised one. It sucks. <laughs> <laughs> As a Ridley main, I can tell you right now, it sucks. <laughs> so you really have to kind of like, you have to space them out. You really have to use down tilt to the best of your ability. Because that's just a moment. You get well, down tilt, order. I mean, I think yeah. the biggest thing would be neutral air. Well, neutral air as well. If you, if you can get yourself like a, a raw neutral air as well, you can get some really ex cute extended combos. But it's just hard because his hands are basically swords. And yeah. Even though you kind of have some disjoints on some of your attacks, Whoa. they're just really hard to beat out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, all that armor was on there. Only the neutral air clipping him, not really doing anything else, though. So. Okay, I like uh, it. Yeah. Yeah, Perfect. And that is one thing that Ridley is going to be able to go ahead and do in this matchup, just because DK does not snap to the ledge immediately. Oh, yep. See, it, okay. it's, it's the worst feeling. But it was a beautiful confirm we saw right off the hand slaps, carrying him right to the sky. True conversion, really, at the moment he gets the grab. So Ridley really has to play like the, the biggest can't be annoying loser you can think of. Now, granted, when he gets DK off the stage like this, he has actually quite a few options to edge guard DK. One probably a little more unorthodox thing. Like, you see him going for the forward tilt a lot, which is a good option, but he also does have, actually, the up special. If he jumps up and angles it down, it hits far below the ledge, and he can grab the ledge and spike him, like right here. Yep. See, he went for it, but could not quite line it up. Yeah, my man cannot mash out of that either. Another forwarder? No, he's just going to turn around and get the back air instead, getting the guarantee kill instead. Oh, he went on stage. I don't think he wanted that. He's going to get scooped up immediately, too. Okay. okay. Yeah, he was trying to look for a defensive option. I like that overlay did not give it to him, though. Yeah, yeah. Really got recovery. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right. Oh, what did, oh. Why did you do this? Why okay. did you do, the reverse hit in there? Okay. <laughs> See, I'm actually surprised he's not... Because you, you can jump like... Oh, yeah, that's great, yeah, great option. Goodbye. Great option. Just go ahead and throw your life away. You know he has to recover low. Let's go for the suicide down air. Confirm the win right there. Yeah, and that spike is actually really strong. It, it, it kills off the side as well. If someone's oh, juggling yeah, no, no, you no, a yeah. lot, you can just throw it out. It's, hey, yeah. but I'm talking about the spike hitbox itself. Like, yeah, oh, it's I huge. think people die to like 30. It is uh, not forgiving, as it shouldn't be. Just yeah. based off the nature I mean, he, of that, he's you going got... straight down. If he does it off stage, you know he's not coming back. It's, it's as traditional of a dive kick you can get, he nope. <laughs> just <laughs> plants himself in the ground. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, here we go. Game two now. Overlay did take game one. Now IDK, you know, trying to make some things happen. Alright, he finds himself right back off stage. Double oh, forward no, air, that's... triple forward air. You definitely want to DI away on that. I'll grant on bigger characters. You're going to get at least two, generally. Yeah, he's um, in the 83% already. Just like that. Giant Punch, not going to find him anything. Reverse Nair into the back air. Woo that's exactly what that I was, was talking actually about earlier. Chris. If you can get the reverse Nair, you can get yourself some very cute conversions. Once again, we saw right to the grab. He was able to DI it a little bit better that time. Well, it's too high. Couldn't get a whole, whole lot. Okay, he's trying to look for that instant spiking hitbox on the uppie like you were talking about a little earlier, Flambo. Oh. But IDK with the immediate God. answer there. Up to backer, backer, backer. So I'm like, it feels like it should be a 50-50 matchup. I, I, to this day, I cannot tell. They just have some very strong tools that they can use against each other. Look, yeah, they just mess each other. Yeah, they, they, <laughs> they scrap. You know, they, they scrap. Wow. It's, it's just one of those things where it's just like, yeah, I, I feel like the matchup's good, <laughs> but then I die. But then I got hit once by a back air, and I just died. You know? <laughs> like, oh. Because Ridley suffers from getting chained by it, like we saw earlier mm -hmm. there before. And he has the grab conversions as well. So it really just depends on who can yeah, get shoot, the opening shoot the first. Shoot the plasma. Shoot the spire out. What, what DK gonna do? Yeah, especially if he manages to line him up. That's 36% he gets unanswered, so. I mean, DK can only out. slap one. Like, you're talking <laughs> about his hands are swords, but if you toss out more than that, you can't get past it. It's like, you get free shield damage on it as well. Yep. That's exactly what I was Off talking the about. Side, before. Yep. It's just, it's a very strong, kind of unorthodox move, but because of the kind of weird timing it has, the delay on it, you're really able to just kind of catch people by surprise and kill them with it. I mean, it's like Bowser's downer, really. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like Sheik or like ZSS or something. Yeah, like when you're, when you're just not ready for the option where you condition that, you know, I'm going to be a good player and I'm going to find a way onto the stage. And it's like, you know what? I'm, I'm turning my brain off. I'm going to hit <laughs> just, I'm going to just do it. Okay, but he does have that entirely charged punch. Ooh. Couldn't get the conversion there. Missed attack, but yeah. still the Well, he went, for, he went for forward toes. Yeah. Toe, so it's not going to connect. Yeah, there goes attack. Air dodge as well. Getting hit by the getup attack. The fist coming through. 
what are you gonna do here? Okay. We have super armor coming beautiful. through That's and the KO. Yep. Yeah, man. He took some percent, but he's able to go ahead and get away with that stock. Up by IDK right back off stage. Down tilt? No, he's gonna go for the board tilt to try to go ahead and get the stock instead. Oh, but he goes with a little bit of a higher recovery. So he wasn't able to get yeah, he's been going high over and over right now. He does not I think Overlay spiked. needs to kind of recognize that and maybe just go for you know, a little, go little for more traditional smash, options. Yeah. yeah, we've not it, seen it, the up really smash the whole time. Is crazy, and especially on a character like DK. Up smash? There's something up there. Tip her up or kill too. Yeah, so it's the right direction. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> That's the matchup in a nutshell. <laughs> <laughs> I had the realization. <laughs> I saw the first like, I was like, wait a minute. And you're like, man, like Ridley's like a pretty like heavy character, but No he's not. He's he's Wario's weight, so like he's decent. He's Wario's I thought he's he was like Dark Samus weight or no, something. No, like he's, okay. he's pretty up okay, there. Okay, he got a little he got a little more thickness on him than I thought. But even then it just like doesn't matter. No. Not, not when you get ding dong like that. Well. And now I'm like now I'm like Am I wrong? Is he, is he not? Or is he not? <laughs> no, 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 no. You're asking the wrong person. I do, I do not know data like that. <laughs> Wait, I'm like, maybe I got to fact check myself. Oh, man. Ch chat, let us know. Add us on Twitter, please. <laughs> please. Let us know. We're, we're not the most educated. I'll tell you that. <laughs> With that said, though, looks like we're going right into game three and one of the most volatile matchups you will ever see, and especially on stage Ooh, like this. Give him that noggin. You got to grab on one of these side plats. Dude, oh, you are seeing yourself to the blast zone. Oh, and, I, you know, and now he's a kill percent. <laughs> yeah, he is. You know, and, and it's terrifying. But in the same vein, like he carries DK off the stage like he is right now. He's made out the defensive option and going to be curtains for IDK as well. So we're going to see who's able to find that opening first. Manages to double jump right over the oppression, but still more coming. Oh, no. Yeah, man, if he was able to set that up in the correct direction, that could have been a very precarious scenario. Yeah, but now IDK taking the stage control, but not respecting the aggressive option from the ledge. Forward air connecting, and then lastly, command grab going to catch him and throws him off the stage. Yeah, and Ridley's command grab is, is, is very weird, um, because it's not like other ones where it's, oh, he just uh -oh. missed a full hop, I guess. Yeah. Um, but it's not the, the kind of command grab where you can just, like, kind of mash out or anything like that. No, it, I mean, it, like you it's, can it's very easily reactable, too, but sometimes if you're just not ready for it, you're still getting caught. It, it, it's weird because it has a 40% window, where if you are within 40% of Ridley, oh, see ya. Um, it, it's either, like, easier or harder to mash out, but yeah, yeah, yeah. depending on if you're in that threshold or not, okay. it determines on how hard it is for you to get out. It's really weird. There's not really any other grab like it. Yeah, I was talking with Larry a little bit earlier. He was like, yeah, I don't know, Ridley's pretty good on the ledge, but he can command grab, he can nair, you can do that. I'm like, Larry, he can command grab? I was like, you, I'm like, you're Wolf, are you just not nairing when you <laughs> see the command grab coming at you? Like, <laughs> Oh, there you go, throw him off stage one more time. Oh, back air, barely getting away from it. Ooh. Up air, not quite gonna do it, no, but there they go, oh, the up smash I'm like, finally coming through. And I'm like, I don't even know if like, DK is just big enough that it hits grounded, or if he started to jump there. I would think so. Yeah, probably, right? Like, it's just so huge. <laughs> if there's anyone I'd expect it to hit, it's him. So. There we go. It's a forward air. That was the full length uh -oh. of that forward air. Uh oh. Oh, he yeah. Oh, yeah. You, you oh, oh, I respect it. I respect it. You missed it. Okay, scoops. Is the spike only on the initial hitbox, or is it like all the way down, too? I believe it's only on the initial. I, I think okay. when it first hits it, oh but I could be goodness, wrong. Oh my goodness, Punch 44 already. IDK getting himself a little bit of momentum, but he held that way! My wow. goodness. Okay. <laughs> I was like, oh, well. Yeah, no, he held that way. Yeah, and then we have be it. Overlay <laughs> taking that set 2-1. Overlay. Over. Really versus DK, though. That's not like a, a matchup you get to watch mm -hmm. often. It's definitely a fun one, though. They it, it really... Beat each other up. It's like watching like a I don't know, box versus ZSS. You know what I mean? Like that. They can really uh, do some stuff to each other. I'll leave it at that. But like I said, it looks like we got. I honestly, I think Fo Fox Mario would probably be the best comparison. Oh, Fox they, Mario. Yeah, they, oh. they get. I mean, we've seen it in Smash 4. We see it in this game. They're both so explosive. They like both Dark Wizzy mess each light. other up. Yeah. yeah. Light versus mm -hmm. Mars. Like, yeah. yeah that's some good one. You already know. That's the East Coast in you. <laughs> <laughs> that's a, that's that's the regional. <laughs> The East Coast Regional. Mm -hmm. Man, he's out there going to overclock. Man, with that said, I've been having a 
quite a good time. Nosebleed aside. Oh, I've had a fantastic time. Nice and good. Though. Probably the, the plane ride catching up with me. Um, oh, well. you, I mean, I took a flight this morning, too, although I'm coming an hour away. Yeah, it was a <laughs> good old six-hour <laughs> flight for me. Nice and uh, I That's the beauty of coming from NorCal. I was like, oh, one-day event? Yeah, I'll catch a Sunday morning yeah. flight. I think I just fly in. Yeah, it's cool. Ca just casually come through. Rather than doing the the, the drive, right? Yeah, pretty, I mean, the drive uh, is six hours. But uh, I don't I don't mind the drive as long as I have a full carport. Because what I end up doing is we kind of split it into shifts. Hey. Where, like, there's a three-hour here, three-hour there, then three-hour here, and three-hour there on the way back. So it works out. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's we, why we I was got, like, we got, we got young, young Ricks. We got Young Rickles. I'm ready to see some Dorf. Now we'll see if he's a... Uh, oh, this is Loser's Pools. Okay, there we go. Good information to have. So we know he didn't make it through the gauntlet oh. of, of amazing players on the winner's okay. side. But we'll see how the Ganon is looking today. Look, but this this helps out for commentary. Because I think he's scheduled for right. the shift after this. And he was like, look, <laughs> he was like, if I'm good as long as I don't make the top 24. <laughs> he might lose on purpose. Hey, you never know. Well, Bandy from Future 2 events nice. for a match fixing, so <laughs> better try. <laughs> Relax, he's not Zach. Hey, oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, hey, hey. You're still throwing shots there, huh? Always. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you mess up once and I never leave, huh? <laughs> that's, uh, that's Twitter cancel culture for you. Mm -hmm. That's the cancel culture. But with that said, I, I don't know. It's been a, a good time coming so far. We're getting down to it, of course. We were talking about before. This is the last Summit qualifier. Um, I'm pretty sure the people we're expecting to make it deep are making it deep. I don't believe there's been any crazy upsets yet. I'll take a view at the bracket real quick just to make sure. But for sure, you know, we still have people like Meister and Winners, Cosmos probably as well. Um, it's one we can start getting to that top 32, top 16, where I'm really going to be interested in seeing what happens.